Imagine you're just chilling on your Minecraft server when all of a sudden hackers make their way into the server, start griefing builds, banning players, and ruining the server for no reason. Would you just stand to the side and let it happen? No, right? So you can understand why I was so mad when I went to spawn and saw this. Like, I mean, there's no need, okay? There's no need to destroy the infuse time. Whoever's doing all this stuff, I'm gonna find out who's behind it, bro. Time. You see, the hackers that are doing this like to stay anonymous. They use a fake account to sneak into the Discord server, and they have an anonymous Twitter account where they post hints to who they are every single day. Now, using this, I'm gonna try and figure out who they are. The only issue with this plan is that so far, none of the tweets that they've posted have helped me at all. Well, that is until they posted this one. So earlier today, this post with Lamedy got posted to the Infuse Finale Twitter account with a screenshot that's probably on Infuse with these red particles around like a chunk. In this screenshot, you can also see shulker boxes. So pair that with the red chunk thing, it makes me think that they're doing a thing called chunk ban, which would also explain their profile picture. You see, if you put enough data into a shulker box and give it to a player, they won't be able to log on anymore and they'll be banned, which is what I think these hackers are trying to do. Now, the reason why this screenshot is so helpful is if this is on Infuse, I can try and match up the screenshot to where it is on the server and try and see if I can find more info at the spot. All right, I turned on the chunk borders feature to see which chunk I'm in, just so I could like, you know, stay safe. Bro, I'm like genuinely so scared because if I walk on the wrong chunk, it's actually over for me. From the image, it looks very flat. Is it this maybe? Like maybe they cleared a little grass afterwards? Oh, bro, this is so annoying. I feel like I can't get any more info no matter what I do. Yeah, we just made a full loop. All right, well, I don't really know how much more I can do, honestly. There's not enough info there. Yeah, no, this isn't gonna work. Realizing that the screenshot didn't have enough info for me to find out where it was, I was pretty bummed out, still being no closer to finding out who these hackers were. And while players were still being banned while I couldn't figure out anything, I started to lose hope. I mean, surely someone has to have some info they could give me for the right price. And that's when I saw that Strife, the player with the dragon egg, a one of one item on the server, was letting people hunt him down to get it. If I could get the dragon egg, someone might be able to give me some info on this whole hacker thing if I give it to them. And so my hunt for Strife to get the dragon egg began. Now, there were a lot of weird Weird chases with this whole thing and i even died a couple times oh, straight for some reason always seemed to respect me in a way so much so that he actually called me to ask do you want a duel completely fair for the dragon egg which i obviously took because i wanted the dragon egg and i don't have much footage from before this because i didn't think it was important because obviously nothing could go wrong from a simple duel Shoot, man. Oh, how did I get in this situation, bro? Please explain. If you left click at any moment, you're dead. If you want to leave this with all your stuff, you have to give me three effects. You're at you're at neutral, right? I think I'll just have to kill you three times. You see, I'm on the Infuse SMP where if you kill someone, you get a positive effect and dying gives you a negative one. In the top right, you can see that I'm on one positive effect. So if Strife kills me three times, I'll have two randomly chosen negative effects, which could be so bad that it would completely stop me from doing the investigation. And I couldn't let that happen. So I had to find out a way to get out of this situation and fast. How about this? If you can give me like a day, I can get you the three effects. Really? Yeah. I don't know if I can trust this. There's no one on this server I can trust right now. Everyone's out for the egg. Well, okay, what have I you done that's do. like not trustworthy? So you're telling me if I let you go, you'll get me three effects before tomorrow? Yes. Do you promise? Yeah, I promise. You know what? Okay. Can okay. I not <laughs> die, please? Okay. How do I get out of this? Do you have a pearl? No. I'll give you a pearl. Oh my gosh, okay. Tomorrow, at this time, I expect three effects. So All right, remember, out. you promised, Rion. I know, I know. Can't back down. Now, I don't know who you think I am, but getting three effects in a single day is pretty much an impossible task. You see, I never actually planned to get the effects, and since he thought it was okay to use crystals even though they're banned, I'm going to give him a taste of his own medicine. I'm doing this while I'm deafened in a call, right? What is this guy doing? What is this guy? Why? Okay, does he? Can, can he hear me? Oh my god! And now, after getting all of the materials, we can now craft the end crystals that are going to end strife, and also save you from getting negative effects, so I can continue working on this old finale thing. Uh, so yeah, now I just have to wait for him to want to meet me, and then hopefully should be done for. And sure enough, 24 hours later, Strife messaged me asking to meet up again, waiting for the three effects that I owed him. The only thing that could go wrong in this situation is if I placed the crystals wrong and ended up killing myself as well. That was a risk I had to take. And even though this thought made me very nervous, I logged back on, ready to take my revenge on Strife. 24 hours ago, you locked me in like a one by one hole with a crystal. You told me that I needed to get three effects and I think you should be treated the same way.
Whoa, whoa, whoa. You didn't even let me speak. Drop that. Drop that right now. Okay, five, 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 five. Hey, wait a second. Why don't you have the dragon egg? Rian. Right after you left yesterday, Sharkills came by for a little visit. If you, if you wondered why I was wearing diamond armor before you blew me up, it's because that was my spare armor. After Sharkills killed me, took my items, and took the egg. I have nothing left. So you don't have the egg? I do not have the egg. It is in possession of shark eels. This literally couldn't have gone worse. All the hunting I did for Strife ended up being for nothing. Shark eels got the egg, and I was left with no leverage to help me with the investigation. Or so I thought. Do you want to Do you want to work together to get the egg back? Now this question sounded stupid to me at first. Why would I want to help Strife get the egg back? But then the more I thought about it, I decided to quickly give him back his armor and rephrase the question a little bit. Okay. I have come back to you after- it was after you offered to work together, okay? And I quickly yeah. turned you away because of my goal to try and figure out this whole finale thing and try and stop it from happening, right? I feel like maybe we could work together to try and figure out what's happening. And if we come across the dragon egg along the way, I'll hand it over to you, but I think- You're gonna give me the egg? Well, if we come across it, then yeah. Okay. But, um, okay. I, I feel like I can't, like, figure this whole finale thing on my own, so would you like to, you know, partner up and try and figure out what's going on with this finale? And try and save our server? I'm willing to help you for the possible chance I can get my egg back. Now that Sheriff was on board and I had someone to help me investigate all this stuff, we are finally back on track to solving the mystery. Now we talked for a while, realizing that there's probably two people behind this whole thing, considering the fact that there's always been two people in every video. And when the next clue got posted to Twitter, to we found out who one of those people was. Oh wait, that's Arch! Yes. Arch is one of the two people. There was another person in that video, which you didn't recognize, right? Yeah, this person? I know who it is. You know who it is? That's Sharkills. He's literally wearing my armor. The green yeah. pants is mine. A couple of days ago, he killed me and took my stuff. And I think that he's wearing my armor, man. No way, that's what gave it away. Okay, so we have the two culprits. Wait, okay, okay. I, s I still kind of want to figure out like how they're like banning people and not getting banned. Do you want to try and find this place and be cautious, obviously? Do you can know where that is? Or I mean, this yeah, looks like this looks like near the spawn of the Nether. Oh, that's true. I think. Wait, that that over there might. Oh my gosh, it's hundred percent one of these portals. Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. Souls? Do you see yeah, that... right above, like, Red Penguin's name, right above the U I N? Do you see those like that the cobblestone block pattern? Yeah. Look right ahead of us. Oh, that's just the cobblestone right there. Is it? Oh yeah, no, no, this is it. This is the Nether rack. And this is the one Nether rack. Yeah. Oh my. Okay, we found. It. Okay, be very wait, careful in going it. through here. We might be able to get chunk bed but this is please so hey before you see what's on the other side of that portal i am so close to hitting 100,000 subscribers like literally less than 2,000 away this will be your final chance to subscribe before i hit 100k unless this video gets like one view or something so please subscribe and get me to 100k and join the discord so you can get the special role that proves you are here before 100k you also get to talk to me there sometimes and you'll get pinged whenever i go live or upload a video i really want to hit 100k so please subscribe join the discord server pinned comment and uh yeah here's what was on the other side of the portal Oh, what? Obsidian box. Wait, we got an, it's Oh, it's like over there! No, 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 it's over there! Oh, okay. Oh, what? Okay, just be very cautious. I don't see any red particles, though, so... It's just an obsidian box. Yeah, the only explanation, they picked it up after. So they can pick it up without getting chunk bent. I think we're gonna have to wait for another clue. Yeah. We'll, we'll find okay. out tomorrow. We'll find out tomorrow. But we did. We got a Keep lot done mind. today. In just a few hours, me and Shrey figured out more than I figured out in days of work. This was definitely a good partnership. And while we were waiting for the next clue, something pretty unexpected happened. You see, remember the Lomini tweet at the beginning of the video about him getting quote unquote banned? Well, apparently that was faked by the hackers because Lomini tweeted about an event he's running today. I wish I was recording my reaction because I literally looked like this emoji, bro. So we showed up to the event and it was this massive house built with golden blocks, diamond blocks, emerald blocks, you name it. And it was really cool to be there. But after he showed us around the house, he had an announcement to make. And this took me and Strife by surprise. I have one last thing to say. You know how a lot of people have been disappearing? Lavi, yeah. yeah. Lucas. Now Arch is a part of the people that ban all of those people. Yeah. Well, there's somebody else that's teaming with him. And I know who, oh. who that is. It's me. 
What the oh hell? What's the armor what? trim? What? The what? Why? Why? Drop the skin, bro. Yeah, what, what are you doing? What are you talking about, bro? What's the point of that? What's the point of revealing it? Like, with everyone on the server here. Where does he go? Dude, where is he? way we lost them bro this completely took me by surprise and it was so weird too something wasn't adding up this would have meant we were completely wrong about sharkles being a part of this and lamedy being a part of it just didn't make sense to me i felt like something was off but i couldn't confirm anything luckily for us the fact that me and strife were investigating this whole thing spread across the server and right after we lost lamedy we got pulled into another vc by a player named diny 4k saying that he had something to show us <laughs> Recorded too, Brian. <laughs> Can you take that off? <laughs> oh, 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 shoot, my fault. Yeah. <laughs> I know a lot of things. A lot of things that could put people in danger, so I'd rather not to sell them. And I've kept this in private because I know by showing to them, it could get more people banned. So whatever I show you guys, keep it between us. This won't yeah, leave so... this won't leave us three until Okay. It better not. Bro. It won't. It better it won't. not. You can trust right, me. Let's see it. So I was on the server and I saw Psykills and Tifoi. I'm like, oh, they're doing something goofy. And I dive down. When I go up, boom. Tifoi left the game. But Psykills is dead. But listen, this is not the best part. Oh, that's the Shulker box. It's the Shulker box. No way. Okay, wait, end your screen so no one can see this, okay? Now, okay, let's talk about the Lomity thing. I don't wait. think he said that on his own free will. I'm not 100% sure, but I don't know why Lomity would join a team that literally bans people that's true this was very helpful Diny, would you, you are you interested in helping me and stripe figure out the, the whole thing the whole story I, i'm down but keep okay. everything in hush and we will we will all right bye bro now i thought the meeting was over but after me and strife left Diny sent me a message saying he wanted to meet up with just me now i don't know why he wanted to exclude strife but he gave us such good info before he had to have known something else okay so Basically, obviously I called you here without Strife. You'll find out soon why Strife, um, I think we're doing a meeting or something like that. You'll find out why Strife is not gonna be with us. You know, try to not tell him anything. This is an IOU that Cycles signed. This book allows you to have full control of Cycles. So when the time comes, we're gonna be doing the meeting. We're gonna use it to get Cycles on our uh, side. All right, this is for you to use at the meeting. Yeah, yo, look behind you. What the hell? Ah. This plan made a lot of sense to me since IOUs are a very respected thing on the server. You have to listen to them if you sign one. So we could 100% get Sharkles on our side, which is great, but I still don't know why they wouldn't let Strife be there. And even though I was confused by this, I showed up to the meeting. <laughs> now first, obviously we got Sharkles on our team with the IOU. I'm gonna cast this IOU in and you're basically on our side now. You won't do anything <laughs> with the other side. You won't do anything sketchy. And then the reason why Strife wasn't there was revealed to me. Me me and Arch started out, just us two. And well, we needed people. Rian, I know your team you're working with Strife right now to save the server, but he's not your friend. He's working with Arch and Squid. And those three are gonna be the people that try to stop us and try to end the server of the it's finale. Okay, I'm here for you, bro. I'm here for you. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Your body that you were investigating everything with He's Match the guy me. that's gonna help end the server. The entire time me and Strife were investigating, he's been on the enemy team. He's just been using me to get info. It's the whole reason why he asked to work with me in the first place. And I was very upset. And after learning about this, there was nothing I wanted to do more than to take down the team of hackers. Not only for all the banning they've done, but to make sure Strife doesn't win. So we came up with a plan on how we were gonna do this. Sharkles taught us about how the band boxes actually work, and it seemed like the only option to stop them would be to sacrifice some people to ban the hackers. Now the plugin for the banning had two shulker boxes made. One that could ban everyone except for Sharkles and Arch, and one that could bypass that code and ban both of them as well. So we had to use the OP band box to ban Arch. And if we could do that, we could save the server. So we all showed up to spawn for one last time, fighting to give Infuse a happy ending. The only way we're winning this is if I use the, the ban box, the ban arch. This might be the last time we're here together, so I just want to say thank you oh, for everything. Watch. No matter what, let's say, let's, let's just pretend in your ideal world you win, okay? The damage is done. Listen, arch, I'm done talking.
Let's end this. Okay. Well, oh, oh my wait, god. Wait, already? Oh my god. Yeah, get away from Arch. Get away from Arch. Use your pearls. Use your pearls. Use your pearls. Slow me this time. JJ's gone. JJ's gone. What? Is what? Is strife. Oh, 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 oh strife. Oh, I, we're ending it here. Oh my god, dude. Stop. Oh, I'm, I'm gone. I'm gone. What? Yeah, Lomity's not on our side, bro. What? Nobody knows what's good for the server. Your entire team is a bunch of hypocrites. I hope you realize that, bro. I hope you realize that none of us are the good guy. What do you think this is? Is it Tiny, bro? Tiny, your best friend? Run up to him. Stop, stop, stop. Look, I have Thomas. Witness this, bro. Like, come over here, Lomadi. A suicide no. bomb. What, what are you gonna what? do? Are you afraid? Danny, are you afraid? Danny, bro, what stop. Is wrong with you? you have a bandbox? Look, look, look. Oh, again. Wait, nice that's right. Wait. Oh, wait, how is he not banned? Oh, With Danny having access to console, he found the code before the fight started and added himself to the ignore list. Meaning he could also ban players now. What's good, man? Yo, Lomadi, come over here, cousin. Hell no, bro. No, no come What? Let's have a little chat. Oh, my. Danny. Oh. Exactly no! <laughs> Whatever you do, it's uh, over for both of us. Danny, you gotta go together. Danny, this was Danny. This wasn't. Wait, you, you, you mean... wanna go together? Let's go together, cousin. Time. <laughs> yeah! And so we all stared at the band screen, seeing right in front of us that the server we've played on for months and made so many memories on has ended. But we all agreed that that was the most fun thing we've done in forever. All good things must come to an end. And as the second season of Infuse SMP ends, the third one is just beginning. On October 7th at 12 p.m. EST at Twitch.tv slash Reround. Be there, please to follow me. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to go watch this one next where I sneak into a Minecraft cult. I promise you'll love it just as much as this one.